The Juki DDL8000A is a really impressive machine with an auto foot lift, really fast sewing speeds. It's got a bar tack feature, of course, an automatic back tack feature, and even has rectangular sewing settings. This machine can be seen to many as a replacement for the 8700-7 to get a more automated machine at a more friendly price. This machine even tells you when it needs oil and it resets itself automatically after you add the oil. This machine actually talks you through a lot of features. And of course you can still adjust the stitch width with a knob. Here we see a back tack set. Now you still have manual knobs for uh, tension adjustment and uh, pressure foot adjustment and that sort of thing. But the majority of it is all automated now with that electronic panel that you see there. Another thing that really shines about this machine is how high this foot lift is. You can really double down and even quadruple your material in a lot of cases very easy. There's three points in the foot clearance positioning, just depending on where you've got your pedal. Very easy to use. So our operator has quadrupled the material here. And as you can see, it stitches right through that without any issue. And I think we're using a size 14 needle right now. But the quadrupled material is not an issue. So our operator wants to see more clearly what this foot lift can do. So we have eight layers of material being sewn at this moment. <laughs> Later we tried to double that over for 16 layers and we did break the needle. Because like I said, I think it was a 14. Uh, my operator said that it would be handy to have a 16. So changing out the needle is still manual. Obviously, there's, there's not anything automated for that in the world yet, but that's easy enough to change. Just make sure your scarf is facing inward to the neck. Better job. And it's just loosening and tightening that set screw on the side there. So for the back tack, you can set it for automatic, but you also have this back tack button so you can back tack as you want. That's the lower of the two buttons on the machine right there at the end of the head. So that's a really handy feature. And of course you still have the lever, but this upper button is a half stitch button. So when finishing out or beginning a certain complex stitch, you can really slow it down and get very precise with what you need. So you can go as slow as you need to or as fast as you need to. It's a very fast machine. If you need to tighten the presser foot, that's still the same standard operation. Loosen the lock nut, get it where you want, tighten the lock nut back down, run it through.
really good stitches. Very consistent. Here our operators just adjusted for a smaller stitch. You can see the differences here. So the auto back tack can be adjusted for a wide array of settings on how many, how many times it back tacks. Here's the bar tack and you can really change up how many times you want the stitch count for on the bar tack as well. You can make really short bar tacks that are very dense. You can make long dense bar tacks whatever you're really looking to do. It's pretty amazing. My operator had never seen this machine before this morning and he had it figured out in about five minutes. And he's a sewing machine repair guy, so he doesn't even really sew much, but this was very intuitive, very easy. Look at that thick bar tack been produced right here. That would hold, I don't know, like a backpack strap with a very full backpack very easily. Look how thick some of these bar tacks and back tacks are. Changing to rectangular stitching. Now here's a really cool feature that you're not gonna see on a lot of machines and its ability to do a half stitch is really what pulls this together. So you can do rectangular sewing and you can set rectangular up to a square setting you can have it stitch in different amounts so they're not perfect, or you can have perfect squares or perfect rectangles. It's, it's really up to you what you set it at. This is probably the most intuitive Juki machine we've seen yet for the industrial machines and its impressive scope of abilities really make it one of the most desired machines, especially with this lower price point that Juki's come out with to more or less just compete with the modern market space of industrial machines. So we're really proud to have this in our showroom and in stock. Again, this is the Juki DDL 8000A, a big step up from the manual DDL 8700.